We're outside the King Yuan Electronics Company. It is a key manufacturing hub for semiconductor testing around 100 kilometers southwest of Taipei. And it's one of three Taiwanese tech companies that are grappling right now with clusters of COVID-19 infection. This company is by far the hardest hit. They had to suspend their operations for two days, test more than 7,000 people, their entire workforce. So far, as of Sunday, they found around 200 cases, most of them among migrant workers, people living in cramped dormitories, often with reportedly unsanitary conditions. If this sounds familiar, it's because we've seen similar outbreaks among migrant workers last year in Singapore and Malaysia and earlier this year in Thailand. So the migrant workers here in Taiwan now have a 14-day paid quarantine. And while this company has resumed operations, it's only Taiwanese local employees who are on duty right now. And this poses a grave threat to an already vulnerable semiconductor industry. Taiwan is the world's leading chip manufacturer. These chips power everything from automobiles to smartphones. And any sort of disruption to the supply chain could really have global ramifications. That's why the Taiwanese. 请订阅、按赞、分享 TVBS 新闻频道，并开启小铃铛，也请下载 TVBS 新闻 APP， 随时掌握国内外大事。